Hello TechMates, I'm Chris and I'd like to show you how to do simple but useful tasks on the Wraith. On this video I'm going to be moving through text, selecting text, cutting text and pasting text. As simple as it gets. Let's start with this layer. You can have your arrows on your main layer. The only problem with this is that when you have to use modifiers at the same time as your arrows, you have to use both hands. One hand would be pressing the modifier on one side of the Wraith and the other hand would be pressing the arrow keys at the same time. There's a slight variation of this layout, which would be this one with the up and down arrows on different lines. And there's a, yet another variation. Yeah, there's actually someone who uses this. This is actually the layer I use on my Windows computer. You can see that all the modifiers are made for Windows, but today we're going to be working on Mac. So let me show you the same layer with the modifiers applied to Mac instead of Windows. This is the layer I use every day. This is my main typing layer. And as you can see, I have the shift to one key here, which I would press with my thumb. And this would move me to layer one where I have my arrows and a few modifiers. As you can see, when I hold my left thumb, I'm shifting to the arrow key layer, and then I can move through text up and down, individual letters if I just press the arrows, but if I hold a modifier like the left alt, I can move full words or full paragraphs. If you go up and down or left and right. And if I hold this modifier, which is the shift plus left alt, I would shift layer, hold modifier. And now I select full paragraphs up and down or full words left and right. Now, when I have selected what I want, I would just cut it, move with just my arrows, and then paste it. To cut and paste, you can see that I have the cut, copy, and paste shortcuts here. So I can select this full phrase, cut it, move to a different place, And paste and that's it for today as you can see I just showed you a few examples of how to do this but you can actually have your modifiers anywhere else on the layer you can have the arrows anywhere else on the layer and I use my right hand on the right side of the keyboard because I'm left-handed and I don't want to let go of my mouse but if you want to do the opposite you can just switch halves as you can see the layout is mirrored on both sides of the race so you can choose which hand to use your mouse with I hope you liked this simple guide and thank you for being there. If you want these layers, you can find them on the link on the description below.